Hello and welcome to my general knowledge multiple choice quiz. There are 25 questions, a few of which are trivia. You'll have around 10 seconds to answer each. I hope you enjoy and good luck. Number one, also known as a carboy, a glass or plastic vessel used in fermenting beverages such as wine or beer is called what? A demi jack, demi jules, or demi john? It's called a demi john. Number two, used during the Middle Ages, what type of weapon was a trebuchet? A longbow, a battering ram, or a catapult? It was a catapult. Number three, by number of fans, after football slash soccer, what is the most popular sport in the world? Tennis, rugby, or cricket? It is cricket. Around 2.5 billion fans, quite amazing. Number four, PQ-17 was the code name for an allied convoy during World War II. Which mode of transport was involved? Boats, trains, or trucks? It was boats. Number five, complete this well-known proverb. The what is mightier than the sword? Brain, pen, or shield? The pen is mightier than the sword. Number six, Charleston is the capital of which US state? North Dakota, West Virginia, or South Carolina? It's the capital of West Virginia. Number seven, in which year was the fall of the Berlin Wall? 1985, 1987, or 1989? was in 1989. Number eight, the Simpson Desert is located in which country? The USA, Egypt, or Australia? It's found in Australia. Number nine, the song As Time Goes By was famously used in which film? It's A Wonderful Life, Gone With The Winds, or Casablanca? It was used in Casablanca. Number 10. Lepidopterology is the study of what? Snakes, butterflies or fish? It's the study of butterflies. Number 11. Jane Eyre was written by which of the Bronte sisters? Emily, Anne or Charlotte? was written by Charlotte Bronte. Number 12. Which of these tech companies launched the earliest? Facebook, Skype or YouTube? A difficult one, this one very close. The answer is Skype, uh, 2003. Number 13. Which of these was most likely use a filibuster? A politician, a lawyer or a fireman? used by a politician. Number 14. What is a Gibson Flying V? A plain ice hockey, a guitar, or a solar powered plane? It's a guitar. Number 15. Percy Spencer invented which electrical kitchen appliance in 1945? The blender, microwave, or toaster? Thank you very much, Percy. It was the microwave. Number 16. The area of medicine called bariatrics deals with what condition? Colour blindness, brittle bone disease, or obesity? It deals with obesity. Number 17. In athletics, what is the only sport where the women's world record is greater than the men's? Shot put? Javelin or discus? It's 
Always a good quiz question to know. It is the discus, and there are the records. Number 18. Which part of the ginger plant provides the spice? The root, the flower, or the fruit? It's provided by the root. Number 19. Paramaribo is the capital of which South American country? Suriname, Guyana, or Venezuela? It's the capital of Suriname. Number 20. What colour is a mineral malachite? Yellow, purple, or green? Very well done if you said green. Number 21. Approximately, when did life on Earth begin? 370 million years ago, 3.7 billion years ago, or 13.7 billion years ago? It was 3.7 billion years ago. Number 22. A nice easy one if you're from the US. In which year was the Declaration of Independence signed in the United States? 1776, 1786, or 1796? The answer is 1776. And if you are from the US, happy Independence Day. I hope you're having a marvellous time. Number 23. Trinity was the code name of the first detonation of a nuclear weapon. Where did it take place? New Mexico, Alaska, or Guam? It took place in New Mexico. Number 24. Which car company has a model called the Clubman? Kia, Mini, or Ford? It's the Mini Clubman. And the last one, number 25. In Shakespeare's Romeo and Juliet, who died first? Romeo, Juliet, or they died at the same time? It was Romeo. And now for a bonus question, just a bit of fun. Can you name the film title from this movie poster that's had all of the text removed? If you think you know it, tell me in the comments below. So that's the end of the quiz. A really big thank you for playing, truly is appreciated. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, please click the like button and to subscribe, please click on the logo. Have a lovely evening. Thank you again and bye bye.